I'm Lisa Jones at Two Works For You. Here are today's top stories. Several groups are protesting a deputy training course scheduled this week taught by Petty, Betty Shelby. You may recall Shelby is the former Tulsa police officer acquitted of manslaughter after shooting Terrence Crutcher nearly two years ago. She'll be leading a class for Tulsa County deputies on surviving the aftermath of officer-involved shootings. A Facebook post by the group Aware Tulsa says Crutcher's family will participate in the protest along with some other activists. It's scheduled for noon at the Tulsa County Courthouse. Shelby is now a deputy for the Rogers County Sheriff's Office. Tulsa police are searching for mass gunmen who robbed and pistol whipped several people. This happened overnight at the Stonecrest Apartments near 41st and 129th East Avenue. Officers say the three suspects broke into an apartment, stole wallets and cell phones, and then physically assaulted the people inside. The people that were hurt were taken to the hospital but are expected to be okay. And we are just one day away from the 2018 runoff election. The biggest item on the ballot is the Republican race for governor. The gubernatorial runoff between former Oklahoma City Mayor Mick Cornett and Jinx businessman Kevin Stitt is the first on the Republican side in Oklahoma since 1990. Both will be stumping for supporters today. The winner will face longtime former State Attorney General Drew Democrat Drew Edmondson in November. And let's get a check of today's forecast from meteorologist Brandon Woolley. Good afternoon, Lisa, and good afternoon, everyone. 94 degrees in Tulsa today, sunny and breezy conditions. Those winds between 15 and 25 miles per hour. Tomorrow on your Tuesday, 95, mostly sunny, with an increasing chance for showers and thunderstorms on Wednesday. A bit cooler, that looks good into the upper 80s, still into the upper 80s on Thursday with some more showers.